Dear parent that brings their child water during the game. You're creating an entitled, needy, reliant brat. There's a certain age where a child will have to think for themselves. For me, that was about 10. As I had an older brother that would unmercifully make fun of me if I did anything that could be viewed as being soft. Got it. No. Once, while playing a game at Millerville Academy, my mom, Mary, who's I a, used to play there too. Yep. Didn't we all? Yeah. Great place. They tore it down. They had a good field. Put a target there. Oh. Once, yeah, while playing yeah. a game at Millerville Academy, my, Academy, my mom, Mary, who's a beautiful, loving, and caring woman, brought me a yellow Gatorade to the dugout. I remember the color. It was unbearably hot, and her baby looked like he could use a drink. My brother Wes just so happened to be at the game that day. Just as I opened up the cap, a hulking figure jumped in the dugout and slapped the drink out of my hand, spilling it all over me and the ground. Aww. At the time, I was mad, Matt. Maybe maybe a little more embarrassed, embarrassed. than anything. I'd have yeah. been sad. Actually, I probably would have punched him in the face. But it was on that hot summer day I learned a valuable lesson. Mm. You've got to think for yourself. Mm. Yeah. But more importantly, it's better to risk dehydration than to be that mama's boy punk. Mm. And thankfully, my brother Wes was there to save me. Mm. I don't know that I agree with this at all. If you have ever carried your child's gear to or from the car to the field, mm. I'm talking to you now. Okay, got it. We're not talking about the ones that bring him water during the game. No. Okay, got it. If your child isn't strong enough or in good enough shape to carry their own crap, then maybe they shouldn't be playing the sport. Mm. Makes sense. May I suggest you look into the band? I hear the flute is lightweight and very easy to carry. Why would you go? Why would you go on band people? Nothing drives me more crazy than a mom or a dad lugging around useless equipment to and from the field. All you need to play the game of baseball is a bat, a glove, and catcher's gear if you so happen to play that position. Really, you don't even need a bat because you can borrow you someone else's. You You really just need a glove and a uniform and a jock strap. And a cup. And a cup. You said jock strap. You admitted jock straps are. Well, you need a jock strap for a cup. Right. Why in the world would a shortstop need a giant bat bag? It's my question. No, you wouldn't. There's no, I, you don't. Matt, the best youth player to ever walk the planet and Muso's idol, Benny the Jet Rodriguez, because they wear the same hat. <laughs> I think he did burn that hat. He did. Finally. Benny would walk. He walked his butt to the sandlot with yeah. a beat up glove. Yep. An old bat and a pair of PF flyers on his feet and proceeded to dominate. And he put the bat, the glove through, through the, bat the bat and just walked. I once watched a mom carry her son's bat bag almost a mile from our furthest field attraction to the parking lot. Mm. Meanwhile, her little brat chatted it up with his buddies following behind. Mm. The poor lady almost had a heat stroke, but little Johnny felt just fine. Oh, good. Mm -hmm. My goodness. Oh, and the kid was 12, too, by the oh, way. We're not talking about like wow. a five-year-old. Wow. I hope this message hits home to some of you. And to those who aren't creating adults that will live in their parents' basement till they're 40, next time you see this madness, calmly walk up to the offender and do like my brother Wes did. Just slap that junk right out of their hands. Sincerely, Ryan. 